What's up? Welcome back to the channel. We're back at it with more Emerge NYC gameplay. We're doing another viewer request today. We'll be doing some tiller ladder action with uh, a ladder company 175 on the Brooklyn map. You definitely want to catch this one. Be sure to hit that thumbs up and let's get started. All right, guys, we just had our fire call in. It's going to be at the Missouri Carriage Company here. Uh, who do we have responding to this? Uh, 227, 222, 234, 123, ladder 123, tower 111, battalion 38. All right, what we're going to do on this is I, I'm basically, uh, the premise behind this is that uh, engine 234 and ladder 123 are on another call somewhere. And so uh, engine 255 and uh, ladder 175 are going to be filling in for them. And then we'll bring in everyone else to fill out this alarm. Um, yeah, I think we'll probably do at least a first. I don't know if we'll go through the full second, but we'll at least do a first. So we'll see about getting this stuff spawned in and then uh, getting everything responding. All right, I've got everything spawned in, so we're going to go ahead and start bringing some stuff here. Let's see, 227 is first due, so we'll grab him. We'll uh, we'll bring him in on, I think, this hydrant right here. And uh, who else we got? Uh, 222. Let's see, let's look at our hydrant situation here again real fast. Uh, got another one on the other corner down here. Oh, yeah, two more, so that'll work out pretty good then, I think. Because we can't really gain access to this side over here, unfortunately. So, all right, yeah, let's bring uh, two, two, two. Turn that down just a little bit. It's kind of loud. All right, yeah, let's bring two, two, two right here. Uh, now we need Tower One Eleven. Let's get him here. I think what we're gonna do is put One Eleven down here on this corner. Kind oh, of not the greatest position because of the uh, the elevated train there, the elevated subway. We'll put him right there. Uh, we'll bring in 214. Yeah, let's do that. Let's bring in 214. We're going to put him on this hydrant right here. And what else we got? Uh, Battalion 38. We'll bring him. We'll put him in on the scene. I think what we'll do is park him right here. And uh, we got squad 252. We're bringing them. They're going to be acting as a fast team. So we'll bring them. Let's see. Where can we put squad? Eh, I think right there would be good. All right. Let's go ahead and bring uh, ladder 175. We'll bring him. Get him set up. Hopefully he works. Hopefully he works. Uh, the last few times we've taken him out, uh, we could respond with him, but we couldn't go through the motions of setting him up and like actually, you know, employing him. So hopefully we can today. Everyone loves the tiller ladders, man. It's like the, it's like some of the most requested equipment. Everyone loves tiller ladder action. All right, let's get him going. Uh, and something else I want to do really fast before we get going too much on this. I want to change the time. We're gonna do this. Uh, Let's actually do this late evening. Let's see, it's going to be uh, 1836. Yeah, that sounds good. All right, let's get rolling. We won't have too far of a response, I don't think. I got to figure out how we're going to do this exactly. Uh, where are we going to put this guy? Oh, we got another unit responding. That's cool. Uh, two more coming in. Nice. All right, let's see. How are we going to do this? I think... I think back to the left. Try not to swing him around into that pillar right there. It's kind of tough with these things. Man, I can't see worth a damn either. Like, it is so... There we go. That's better. Now I can actually see what I'm doing. Yeah, I think we're going to put this guy in over here. We got the entire, entire uh, top floor is like fully involved. There we go. That should be good for now. All right, set the parking brake. Let's hop out. Let's see what we got going on here. Getting our turnout gear. Let's stand on the car for a second. I'm sure they'll appreciate that. Uh, turnout gear. There we go. 
Oh, uh, yeah. Yeah, fully involved. But you know what? I think we could make some interior tax on that. Like, I, I think that's doable if we go ahead and we hit it fast. Because it's only on the second floor, so. Let's, uh, let's get this guy deployed. Yeah, let's get him deployed. And I think we're going to go to the floor below here. We'll do that. I don't think it's wanting to bust the uh, bust the glass. It doesn't seem like it. Let's hop down. And we'll grab a hook. See if we can get it ourselves. We're going to try. I don't know. Maybe not. This may not work out. What does climbing look like first person? You know, we've never done this first person. Uh, yeah, it's all right. Yeah, we're not going to be able to... Uh, yeah, we can't get out of the climbing animation to uh, to break the glass, unfortunately. Like, that isn't, isn't going to happen. Yeah, okay, never mind. And the uh, ladder won't break it for whatever reason. You could do that. You used to could knock the glass out. Unfortunately not. All right, we need to... Let's just hop down. Let's put this back, and let's get a water supply going. Let's get a hand line in there real fast. Oh, come on, put it back. Oh, it's in the other hand. Never mind. Forgot. It swaps it out when you climb. Now we can put it back. All right, yeah, let's get a supply going and let's get some hand lines in there and at least try to keep it from spreading um, spreading downstairs. Oh, we got to bring 255 as well, too. Yeah, I forgot about them. We need to bring them. Something a little bit different. Some other uh, pieces of equipment that we don't usually, you know, take out. What does it look like? Is it still not... Yeah, it's it's okay. I think we can jump on two five five real fast. Hopefully we won't regret this, but see where's he at? There he is. Yeah, these units are units that I usually always uh AI in, like you never uh you never see them driven in video, so Alright, let's see. Where do we need to go with this? And I think, I think we can make this wrong way, but it'll be all right. We'll use the bike lane. It's all right. We'll use the bike lane. It'll be okay. <laughs> we'll get it. We'll get there one way or another. There we go. Oh man, look at that. That top floor is going, man. Okay, yeah, let's put this guy on his hydrant. Okay, we got lots of water supply here. Like, this is the most water supply I think we've ever had in a video, right? Like, I really think it is. Man, look at that. That looks so good. Yeah, it does. That's going good. All right, let's let's uh, let's grab a hand line. Let's stretch a hand line in there, see if we can start getting some water on this. At least kind of uh, a defensive uh, position. Try to keep it from going downstairs. Uh, I think we actually need to keep pulling. We need to keep pulling some line off first. We'll do that. There we go. Alright, yeah, it will eventually spread downstairs, so... I've had this one before where it was fully involved. I think it was on the Manhattan map. And this is one of those fires where uh, it was hard for me to play it in the past. Like, it got so incredibly laggy and uh, just, just really, really bad. But uh, since the performance update, I have zero issues with it. Like, we can go in there, we can have fire top to bottom all day long, every day, and it won't, uh, it won't really hurt anything. All right, we got water going here. Uh, yeah, we may have to... Oh, yeah, it looks like it's starting to spread to the, um... Yeah, it's going to the second floor. Shoot. Yeah, let's hit it real fast. It may be too late, guys. We'll see.
All right, we got that going up. Yeah, I think we may have saved it from going to the second floor. Oh, no, there's still some more over here. Never mind. Let's hit it. <laughs> we got to save the second floor. Man on a mission. We got to save it. Quick. Quick, spur, quick. Get some water on it. I've had this one another time back in the day where I came in here. It was exactly like this, the same scenario, and it just kept spreading and spreading and spreading like I couldn't stop it. Like, I, I literally, I could not stop it. See, it's already going around. It's already going around. Yeah, it's, it's going around. It's going around the floor now. You can see it, these windows over here. This is a fire where you really need to bring hose packs in. I wish we had a, a hookup in the building. Like, that would help a lot on this particular fire. You know, these buildings are not built to code. Like, they, they, don't have, uh, they don't have water hookups inside. They don't have the standpipes, so. All right, maybe we're okay with that. This will work out real nice. I know we had someone leave a comment that said, uh, can we just do a, a hand line? Absolutely, I love doing a hand line. Yeah, it keeps spreading around, see? Luckily, it's just sticking along the walls here. Yeah, she's going good. She's going real good, guys. I think we might actually have to uh, bust out some air for this one. Yeah, see, it's down on the other end now. We're just like, we're just chasing the fire, basically, is what we're doing. We're chasing it around. There we go. We're putting up a fight, though. We are. We're putting up a fight. I refuse to let this uh, second floor go up. We're putting up a fight. What usually happens is, like, you get distracted on another fire. Let's say we start hitting the uh, the top floor. I guess it would be the third floor. And uh, while you're distracted fighting, that is when it sneaks around behind you and, and starts, like, getting the floors below. So it could very well be on the bottom floor, too, now. Like, we might need to go check that real fast. Yeah, we're getting tangled up. Yeah, I think we're all right. Let's go ahead and hit it. Like, I'm having a hard time moving this hose around, so. There we go. Now we're getting Now we knocked it back a little bit, at least. Yeah, look at that. Look at that ceiling, man. There we go. Yeah, it's going good up there. I've always said there's something so satisfying about putting water on the fire and just like cooling the walls, like cooling the, uh, the hot walls and stuff like that. All right, we're out of air. So either we're going to have to tough this out with um, no air and just eat smoke or, yeah, okay, we're good downstairs. I think we can tough it out. Let's do that. Let's tough it out. That's kind of odd. Even the, uh, the water isn't knocking the windows out. So I don't know what's up with that. Usually it does. Oh, damn. Yeah, that's killing me really fast. Maybe we need air. Yeah, <laughs> we need air. On second thought, we need some air. We need air. Let's go back down. Uh, that sucks because I can't drop the line up here and just go grab it. Like, we have to take everything with us because I guarantee, I guarantee without a doubt, once we drop this hand line up there, it'll be gone. Like, there will be no getting it back. And then we'll have to do the process over again. So, I'd like to avoid that if I could. So, we'll just... We'll go out, we'll grab a new tank. All right, let's see, let's go to, uh, let's go to third. 
All right, let's drop this guy right here. Hopefully he'll... Yeah, okay. We're good with that. Uh, new air tank. Got to figure out where that's at. It'll be right here, right? Yes, it is. Nice. Good. Yeah, <laughs> I should have won a contest for that one. All right, let's... We don't need that charged. Dude, this helps. At least a little bit. Actually, we don't need that air going either. Not right now. We're going to save it. We have to sip the air, guys. Like, we have to sip it. All right. Well, it looks like we uh, we saved the second floor. We got everything put out and extinguished and uh, got some water on it. So, I think we're good there. Let's go ahead and see about making our attack upstairs now. All right. Come on, bunny hop. Man, these walls are just such a pain. Yeah, we got some fire up here. <laughs> we got some fires up here, guys. All right, let's get down. Charge the line. We get some water on it. It's been a while since we've had a good, solid interior attack. Like, here lately, we've been a little bit more defensive about it. Yeah, we got fire all in the ceiling, too, man. You can see that. Stubborn, too. We may have to hit this with the tower ladder, honestly. There we go. Now it's going out. You can pull these ceilings, but they're so dang high, like they're like you can't hardly reach them. You can't really reach them with the uh, with the pike. So, all right, let's start pushing forward. I think we're good back behind us, right? Eh, there's a little bit in that right there. All right, some of that elevator shaft there. All right, let's keep going. You know, that would be a cool call of uh, stuck elevator, right? Like that's that's one that uh, would be really, really cool to have and we don't have that. So, all right, let's start pressing forward. All right, get this ceiling here. Yeah, it's all in the rafters and stuff. Yeah, it is. Yeah, we'll try to uh, we'll try to get this fire wrapped up. Maybe we'll take another call after this real fast. Nice. I think we're making some good headway, guys. I think we're doing it. Hopefully it's not spreading back downstairs now. I don't think it is. I think once you put it out in an area, it won't, uh, hopefully it won't go back to that area. We'll let the other guys overhaul. Like I said, I haven't figured out a good way to uh, reach the ceiling. I don't think you can, if I remember correctly. I could be totally wrong, but I don't think you can reach the ceiling with a pike. You'd have to get a ladder, and like a ladder would work out okay around the, the walls, like the perimeter, but it wouldn't help you in the middle. Because we don't have like, uh, we don't have like step ladders. There we go. Nice. I'm getting hung up on something here. I don't know what's getting me. Let's take that hood back down. We don't need that. That's the only thing. Your health will creep down on you before you know it, and then you're dead. Sweet. Yeah, 
Oh yeah, we still got it on the front. Luckily, the, the middle part. All these boxes and stuff didn't catch up. It should. That would be awesome if it did. Man, this whole this whole floor could be like a, a blazing inferno, right? Unfortunately, it's just the perimeter though. It's kind of weird how it does that, but. All right, let's hop back up. We don't need to crawl anymore. We should have it, guys. Like, oh, it is starting to catch up in the middle here. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Charge it back up. Well, it's kind of catching up a little bit in the middle here. I guess it's just slow, maybe. Yeah, we're about to get some air going again. That could serve that air, you know. Especially on these big fires where it takes you a minute to get to it. You have to drag a line with you. All right, I think it's pretty much just on these front walls here. Yeah, it looks like it's catching up in the ceiling there, too. I don't know. We may have to go up on the roof and cut it. Like, there's a lot of fire in that ceiling. We may have to go up on the roof and cut it. That'd be a good way to get to it. All right, there we go. I think, I think we might have it. I think we might be able to call this good other than a little mop up. Of course, we're running out of air again. Let's kill that. All right, let's go take a peek. One last time. Yeah, it's still, we got some hot spots here. Let's go ahead and hit that. Sweet, I think that's about got it. Yeah, some of it burned out, some of it didn't. So yeah, we still got some fire in there. I just saw it. I could have swore I saw some, but yeah. It's going through the ceiling. Yeah, that's exactly what it's doing. It's going between um, the ceiling and the roof. Yeah, I think that's what's so sneaky about this fire is how it, it travels through the ceiling. All right, let's work our way back out. I think I still hear it, yeah. We still got some fire somewhere. I'm almost certain. Hopefully it didn't backtrack behind us. Go back downstairs. Yeah, that's the crazy thing about it. Like how it'll travel through walls and through the ceiling and stuff like that. All right, you know what? Let's, uh, let's kill this. Let's go back downstairs. I think what we're going to do is redeploy the ladder. And uh, we'll go. Uh, we'll go check out the roof. Maybe do a little cutting up there. Pull the roof and uh, see what it looks like. So we'll we'll do that. Yeah, I think instead of taking another call, we'll just uh, we'll forego that. We'll do some uh, roof operations and then call it good. That's all stuff we don't hardly ever do, and we get to uh, use one seven five a little bit more. Yeah, we still got black smoke up there, so I think. I think we still have some fire up there. I sure do. Let's see. Let's uh, let's get this guy deployed. Can we go towards the middle there? Maybe a little bit. The ladder pipe. I didn't. Uh, I didn't set that up. 
All right, let's go out. And hopefully... Okay, yeah, we're hitting the building. Doesn't like that. It doesn't like hitting the building, so... I think out a little bit further, maybe. All right, actually, let's hop down and uh, let's get a saw, I think. And a pike. There we go. All right, there's a chain. Uh, we'll take the K-12, actually. We'll take the K-12. We'll take... Um, We'll take a hook. All right, let's go take a peek. Let's see what's going on. Yeah, we still have a little smoke up there. So it's either in the ceiling or on the roof. One of the two. Our dude is winded. He's winded for some reason. He's stuck in the uh, winded audio for some reason. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got some fires up here, guys. We got it. It's all right. We'll get this cut. We'll cut this out. Yeah, right, yeah, let's kneel down. Let's see if we can do it this way. I can't hardly tell what's going on. Like, it doesn't seem to be doing. Oh, did we just go through? Did we just go through the roof? No, we didn't. That's weird. That kind of freaks me out a little bit there. We cut a hole, but. All right, well, it seems to be okay right here anyway, so. That's weird, it collapsed with us. Yeah, it sure is, it's collapsing as we do this. All right, you know what, let's hop up. Oh, this fire is gonna be on the back side. Trying to think of the best way to get that because uh, the tower ladder is not gonna hit it. Yeah, 111 trucks on this side, so we could reposition him and use him to get it, or we could try to get it from below, but we're going to have a really hard time pulling it down, so. Um, yeah, I don't know, guys. We might have to bring 44 truck. He could reach that for sure. We may do that. We may bring 44. I mean, I guess we could stretch a hand line up there, but uh, what would be the fun in that? Let's bring 44 truck. Dude, you're you panting and you gasping. like really annoying. <laughs> it's really super annoying. You need to stop with all that mess, you big drama queen. Seriously, you're fine. You climbed a ladder, you cut a hole in a roof, and you're okay. Let's see. Uh, will some... Uh, Gatorade, fix that. Yeah, okay, we're good with that. Let's drop this stuff down. Let's go get 44 truck real fast. And, uh, drop you there. We'll drop you there. Yeah, we'll get 44 truck. We'll bring him and uh, we'll use him to get that out. If it doesn't burn out, it could very well burn out. All right, let's hit F2. Hit F2 again. Uh, where's 44 at? There we go. That's a good one. 44 is a beast. Nice. All right. Let's get in. Let's get moving. Very cool. I just saw a video, a real life video of 44 uh, in operation the other day. I thought it was pretty neat. All right, let's see which way. Let's go back this way. They're yeah, going down. That's the hardest part about this is like, uh, I know where I want it to go, right? Like I totally know where I want it positioned as far as like in relation to the building itself, but I don't know how I'm coming into that. Oh man, that was just dumb as hell, dude. Just had your front bumper taken off. But I don't know like how I'm, okay, I see now. I can go around and back up. It's just trying to figure out like how you're coming into the scene in relation to the building. 
Yeah, we can't go that way, so what we'll do is we'll just go around through here. Alright, so we'll have to go down and then come back up. should have us right. Why are we getting, why is that ringing on, on us? That's kind of weird. All right, we should be good right here. Let's hop. Uh, there it is right there. Okay, perfect. Yeah, and then we got a, we got an engine right here and a hydrant. So like you couldn't ask for a more accommodating <laughs> fire than this. Perfect. Big 44, nice, I love 44. Mr. Brady stays busy. He works all the tower ladders, like every single one. All right, there we go. Got that down. Uh, let's get our supply established. Let's do that. Go ahead and grab our hydrant wrench. Nice. All right, that's good to go. Drop you down right here. Let's relay to 44. We'll just connect to the rear end here. Get our pump going. We should be set. I didn't hear it spool up. Why did it not spool up? There we go. Must not have clicked it good. That worried me for a second. I was like, damn. But doesn't that figure? Like, just when you have a plan in your mind, something happens to screw it up. And that would be equipment failure, which I'm sure it happens in real life. There's probably nothing that sucks worse than having a uh, engine that can't pump water. There we go. 44 is going to do it for us. Look at that view, right? <laughs> Look at that. Only thing is the white, uh, the pipe. Like, I don't know what's that. What's up with that? All right, let's hit it. Oh, come on now. There we go. Now we're making some headway. We'll have it out in a second. That'll be it. We'll call it a day, end our shift. It may be in the ceiling a little bit too, honestly. I, we should be able to get it with this. We'll keep spraying until the uh, the smoke goes away. If the smoke doesn't go away, then we'll have to go. We'll have to go cut it somehow or pull it. It just got really super dark. I can't even see the smoke hardly. It looks like it might be trying to dissipate. Too bad. These things don't have scene lights on them, do they? Wouldn't that be cool? I mean, I see the light on it, but... It doesn't do anything. Alright, well, we'll go with this for a few minutes, and uh, hopefully it'll get it put out we call it a day. There we go. Man, this thing has some reach to it. I swear. It just goes for days. I think we're good. I think we're about good right here. Yeah, smoke's dissipating. I think we're good, guys. I think we're going to be able to call this one. 
And I forgot, someone said you could hit F1 and uh, you could do 1084 and it would put you on scene. Like, I don't know if it does anything other than that. Like, just going through the motion. Where's it at? I know it's on there somewhere. Yeah, unit is on 1084, so there you go. We're owned. It's a little bit late. Like, the fire's out now, but we're owned. We're owned and then we'll be off. Yeah, I didn't even know that worked. I, I didn't know that worked. And uh, like I said, I think it's just purely for, like, going through the motions. I don't think it actually does anything. All right, let's get back down on the ground and uh, I think we'll call it. Nice, that's such a good looking scene, I love it. I love the nighttime stuff. Lights look great. There we go. All right, let's hop off. Let's take a peek around the front here. Dude, it looks like. Well, it wasn't too bad. Got a little uh, tiller ladder action in. Got uh, big 44 in. Uh, did a lot of uh, attack with the hand line. And uh, I think all in all, is a good fire. Anyway, let's go do it for this one, guys. I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, please be sure to hit that like, subscribe, ring that bell, leave me a comment. Let me know what you think. Love all of you. Thank you so much for the support. And uh, we'll catch you on the streets of Brooklyn next time. Peace.